We didn't talk about it. We never talked about where we came from, what happened, and how we got there. Nobody was interested. Nobody asked. Nobody understands that. Nobody wanted to know anything about anything. Nobody talked to us. You know, and if you said anything, they said, all they said is, oh, you want attention. This was the 50s. Nobody wanted to know in, in the, the early 50s. Community. Yeah, the Jewish community. Were they sensitive to the fact that you had just come and you didn't know anybody? Were they treating you kindly and helping you get settled and organized? They, they didn't know anything about what, what, what was happened. That was the, the problem. Uh -huh. They didn't know anything. Were, were people interested in your war experiences? Did anybody ask you no. about where you had no. been during no. the war? They must have asked about your number. No. I could see in the attitude of other girls and other boys, this was right after the war, we were still young, we were teenagers, that um, they didn't want, they didn't mingle with them. They didn't reach out to them. When, when you have suffered, when one has suffered, for so many years, or even months, or even weeks, you know, one day in Auschwitz was enough to um, to destroy a person's uh, uh, will. <laughs> um, when when you uh, when a, a one comes out of this, and every day thinks that this is the last and then comes to a foreign country, that person isn't going to come up to you and say, hey, do you want to be friends with me? It's up to us to reach out to them and say, tell us about yourself. What has happened? Where do you come from? Nobody or few people did that. So they retreated into themselves. Or they seemed more neurotic than than other people. They didn't have family to lean back on. They didn't have, yeah, to em embrace them. They didn't have family to quarrel with. Mm. I, had, I had family to quarrel with. I quarreled a lot, you know. But I, I had a, a backup. I had sisters, I had parents, I had uh, relatives here in New York, wherever I went. Uh, I had relatives to avoid if I wanted to. They came here without anybody. We just knew about them in a sentence or two. They had to leave Europe and come, uh, you know, for their safety. Even in afternoon Hebrew school, the years of the Holocaust, they just, they just weren't taught or mentioned. So we had no understanding of of these people and what life was like for them and the horrors that I'm sure a lot of them went through and it still doesn't explain or help me feel any better about myself to know that I did not have the compassion to embrace them and that is a horrible admission.